so you know when Danny called me, so that the history of the, the whole XFL here, Danny called me as we all got locked down with COVID, and she says I got a crazy idea. And I said, Don't threaten me with a good time. I love crazy. And she said, uh, I want to buy the XFL. It was the easiest yes I've ever said. So in addition to it being Danny's big dream and all the things that it represents in sports, women in sports, uh, that's so inspiring. For me, this is full circle. I put my hand in the dirt. I love the game of football. Football is going to be my way out, like a lot of these players. Football is going to allow me to buy my parents their first home. We never lived in a home. We are always in apartments and trailers. So it was my ticket. When that didn't happen, dream over. Uh, created a chip, as I told you guys, and then I lived out the rest of my life. But now, years later, for me to be able, Danny, to have this platform create this opportunity for other players who were in my position. Because if the XFL was around, I would have jumped at it many moons ago, 800,000 years ago, when, <laughs> when I was their age. But it's a full circle moment for me just to be here. Be down here at Jackson State, creating this opportunity for players who, I mean, this is his dream. This is 41's dream.